guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here hello and welcome i hope you're sticking around so subscribe to this channel for more vape videos give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it and don't forget to turn on the bell notification so you get notified whenever i upload check the description box below for important links like where to find me outside of youtube facebook instagram and twitter i love my social medias for many reasons but also i do all my vape giveaways over there you're not allowed to do that on youtube so any extra vape stuff that i have i give away over on my facebook instagram and twitter i use twitter to directly chat with you guys and i love instagram the most because of instagram story i love to post there all day every day my eye is watering pretty bad today i don't know why it is actually mother's day the day that i am filming this so happy first mother's day to me and happy mother's day to all the vaping mamas out there watching this you won't be seeing it on mother's day but it counts also in the description box below is a link to my second youtube channel where i do non-vape related videos so if you want to see what else i bring to the internet land you can check that out and there's a link to my vape patreon where the monthly rewards are vape related so e-liquid and kits sent to you monthly check it out if you're interested all the links are below in the description box it's usually down there unless you're watching on like some sort of different app then it might be like over there or over there i'm not sure but anyways let's get into the video and like i'm not oh my gosh you guys my eye <laughs> is watering so bad it's not the makeup i swear my eye will water with or without makeup i'm like kind of like what are we doing with this with this today but i mean i got sent it by directvapor.com my favorite place to shop amazing online vape shop um this is the chroma a kit with the isa b which the isa b and the chroma a are not new them together in a kit form is like the new part and also the uh 3d or the the plex 3d coils so i'm like what i've already looked at the chroma a it came with like the creos tank when it first came out like two, probably two years ago um, and I've also looked at the iSub B, which was one of my favorite tanks for a very, very long time. So neither of these things are new except for the coils and then the fact that they are put together in a kit. And even the coils aren't even that new. So like, I don't know. It comes like this and then you have the accessories box and you have the kit contents over here. So we'll go ahead and look through the, the accessories. And I mean... Like I said, I'm not like super excited about this because it's uh -oh. it's all stuff I've looked at before. So we do have a tank band in here. We have some extra O-rings for the tank, a micro USB to USB cord, a little quick start guide. And in this envelope, you have like the warning and safety booklet. You also have the warranty card right here and the verification codes and a little battery warning card. Now on this side is where you get the goodies. So I have the rose gold chroma A here. And this is like, you can see like the iridescent type rainbow for the tank. Here's the iSub B. And that also comes with an extra coil. It's installed with one and a bubble glass. So this is kind of pretty. I mean, it has that going for it. I like the rose gold and I like the little, the shimmer of the iridescence here. I'm like, do I even like break it down and go through it with you guys when we've all already seen this before? Um, to change out the coil, you just spin off the base and you pull out the coil. So here's what is the cool part. It's the 3D, it's the Plexus 3D coil. So you can see down in there really interesting um good flavor this is a 0.35 good between 30 and 55 watts which is i vape like 55 is my number so that's cool i mean that it's really pretty that that is what it has going for it it does have the uh airflow here at the bottom the adjustments with little holes and they are on stoppers we have the 510 connection threading here and the removable drip tip that is like a snake skin design right there to fill it you just unscrew this little top cap and you fill it so i am filling it up today with my cloud kiss flavor it's available in 100 mils it's a strawberry cake batter i love it it's my baby available in 0, 3, 6, 12 milligrams nicotine 70 percent vegetable glycerin 30 percent propylene glycol and you can use my code tia20 for 20 percent off my flavor at bonsaivapor.com bitches so excited okay so i'm gonna put this in here this coil better be like superb because 
it's like that's the whole reason I'm like okay we'll make the video because the coil is supposed to be amazing because I was like I was really like hardcore debating do I do the video or not because both of these products we've already seen so again you've already seen it fire button regulatory buttons micro USB charge port this is the mod at the top we do have the 510 connection and this side is a little screen right in there it has a built-in 2000 milliamp hour battery and it's the traditional Anakin three clicks on <laughs> excuse me and then it's on and you can see what is flashing oh it says same coil nickel titanium stainless steel or wattage and I'm just gonna do wattage because I'm gonna we'll just act like this is a new coil because I have no idea if they've ever put this one on and then it shows everything that the chroma a normally shows and you know what i guess if you're new here or new to vaping as of like last year maybe you didn't see the video of the chroma a and the um creos tank but you can you can go <laughs> look at that video for all the specs of it because this is like this is almost as bad as how um smack or smock or smoke whatever does the re like the similar mods with like that barely have anything different besides what they look like and this is just like the exact same thing they just decided to put an old product and an old product together in a new tank and put a new coil in and call it new i don't know maybe they're losing ideas on innovation i don't know i'm kind of like still salty if you can't tell so this tank is good between 30 and 55 watts i think it was so we're definitely going to do 55. And this mod can go up to 75 watts. So six to 75. We'll just, we'll just do 55. Ooh, don't push play yet. If you press these two buttons together, the plus and minus, you can see the precision reading. Oh my gosh, what is actually going on? It's really hard to see on camera. You can see the, see? And if you press and hold them, it should flip the screen, there we go. If you press the fire button and the plus button at the same time, you can select between the temperature mode. And then when you're in TC mode, if you press and hold the fire button and the minus button, you can change the ramp up of wattage. So three clicks turns it off. And I don't know if you can see, but it's backlit with green. So now it's on and does the red, yellow, green. That is an indicator light for the battery. Red, you need to charge it. Yellow, you got about maybe half or a little bit less. And then green is, almost full or full so after filling up my tank this coil has wicked up a lot of the e-liquid so that's interesting also that's totally fine we're still gonna vape it that way oh my god <laughs> clouds bitch <laughs> i was not prepared for that much cloud mm. my flavor is good it's coming through nicely Hello? Oh, that's an Okay, I needed to kind of take back like all my crap talking in the beginning of the video. This is a good combination. The Chroma A and the Isa B with the Plexus coils, like it's firing right away. It's giving me a ton of vapor, a ton of flavor. It's almost a little force speedy and at 55 watts, it's a little bit warm, but not like too warm. If you know my channel at all or me, I don't like a warm vape, but this is obviously, it's not too warm. It's just something I'd like to point out for you. I tried to do that. It, this one's way too powerful. Um, what did I do it with? I think it was the, it was last week or the week before with one of the pod mods. I did some chain vaping through my nose and everyone was like, that was cool, do it again. I tried to do it with this one, but it's a little too powerful for that. But there's your nose exhale. Um, the flavor is delicious. This, as you can see, so I'm like picking my ear, gross. Um, is a juice guzzling machine right now. Even though the color is beautiful, it's still not like 
a girly enough setup for me to be like, yay, this is like beautiful. It's pretty, but like I need more color than that. Too much, too much black for me personally, but like, did you see it? I mean like, huh, my e liquids, pink and white and gold. Like I'm pretty girly when it comes to that kind of stuff. I'm actually really liking the flavor. I think out of everything about this, it's the flavor that I like more. Sorry, I'm like playing with my hair. It's just like it's hot and it's down and it's boring, but um, yeah, I'm sorry this isn't like the greatest video. It's just like, what else do I say? Like the main focus of this video is that I wanted to bring you the plexus coils within the ISA B. It's all just a great combo. And the flavor is probably, how much it brings out my flavor is probably the best part about it. So you can check out directvapor.com if you want to get this setup in combination. And there are other colors. This is the rose gold. It's pretty, it's just not like a lot of rose gold. That's it for the video. Super quick because like I said, most of you probably know about these products already just like them in combination. <laughs> it's like the new, I don't know, I'm sorry. The next vape video will be way better, so tune in for that one. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below about like Inakin taking two older products and like putting them together to like make a new kit. You know, what do you think? Tell me, spill the tea. <laughs> Am I spilling the tea? One more thing before you go, if vaping is something you're passionate about, please learn how to fight for your right to vape. So as always, I'm Tia and thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.